And again, thank you for joining us. And let me get President up. Obama addressed members of the Business Roundtable at their headquarters in Washington, D.C. this week. Amidst a potential government shutdown and a battle with House GOP members, the U.S. president railed against political adversaries. What we now have is a ideological fight that's been mounted in the House of Representatives that says we're not going to pass a budget and we will threaten a government shutdown unless we repeal the Affordable Care Act. The president continued to say that the average person is a bit confused by raising the debt ceiling, thinking that it increases the federal debt, while in reality it provides money for bills that have already been racked up. Republicans want to fund the government by cutting the new health care program, which Mr. Obama and Democrats are loath to do. As these fiscal deadlines approach, we Democrats are standing strong. We're standing together. And we're sending a strong message to the House. We will not blink. Senate Democrats are rejecting efforts to disable the health care law. Beltway insiders say they're likely to remove the health care provision from the House bill and send it back to the lower chamber. Once that happens, GOP leaders would be faced with risking a government running out of cash to pay its bills or passing a bipartisan temporary spending plan. Meanwhile, these types of political games are not making Congress look good. With the U.S. federal budget being affected, experts say this sends a message that undermines U.S. confidence. It certainly doesn't look like the only economic superpower in the world or the, be the best superpower in the world. And it doesn't look like the power that can really maintain the uh, respect and the value of the dollar as the only international reserve currency in the world. And more alarming predictions from the Congressional Budget Office, which estimates that the U.S. national debt will rise to the level of the nation's economic output in 25 years without a change in fiscal policy. With the government shut down just days away, Republicans are staging a congressional showdown. Some Republicans say they will only vote to raise the debt limit if they defund the new health care law. Other Republicans say that doing that would be political suicide. Colin Campbell, Press TV, Washington.